Hi everyone, welcome to my channel, Tech Teach and Transform. This is day two of our organization of our Google Drive. So we're getting ready for this school year. Um, we are ready to get our stuff organized. So in day one, you got rid of a lot of the archived items that you had, you got, um, you renamed or got rid of some of the copies of, and then you also either um, added in the zip files or got rid of those zip files that are taking up space. So today we're actually going to be naming our main folders in our Google Drive. So we're gonna make our Google Drive main station, okay, where it's like a subway station, the main station organized. Okay, so that's with folders. So before doing anything else, we need to narrow down our focus of our main categories. Okay, so these are your main types of items that are gonna be in your drive. And you're gonna create one folder for each one of those main categories. So for instance, there's probably a lot of educators on here. So if this is your school drive, you're going to create folders that have to deal with parent communication, your subject that you're teaching, professional development maybe, organization, things you purchase from teachers pay teachers, those types of things, okay? Now, if you have a Google Classroom, a Canvas, or a Schoology, you're going to automatically have a folder that is labeled with that because it automatically connects to those platforms, okay? So you can't do anything about those. So just let those be for now, okay? Now you're gonna probably end up creating more main folders throughout the school year, but for right now, let's just get those main ones in, okay? Now, pro tip, you're gonna use all caps for your main folder. So that way you know this is the main folder, this is the starting point for finding the information that I need to find in my Google Drive, okay? now. Here we go. I'm gonna show you how to make folders because we might not know how to do that. And then um, in the next couple of days, we're gonna actually be adding some subfolders and things like that. So we're just gonna get our Google Drive's main dashboard organized. So to create a folder, you're gonna go to New Folder, okay? And I'm just gonna title mine Professional, and remember all caps professional development and then I'm going to put 2122 since it's 2122 school year and I'm just going to hit create now there is my folder now see how you can't really see all of it now if you wanted to you can right click on the folder and you can hit rename and I'm just going to rename it PD 2122 so that way it's a smaller name okay so there it is, PD2122. So today, your task for day two is to create all of your main folders that you want for this school year, the main folders. Now remember, these do not have to stay the same throughout the year, but let's just get started off with the main ones that you want. So for me, I'm gonna add another, I'm gonna add another folder that says reading2122, okay? Now you don't have to put the date, Okay, but I just like to have the date so I know. Okay, there's my reading 2122. So I'm just gonna create these folders and be ready for our next day three challenge. If you have any questions, just put them in the comments below or DM me on my Facebook or Instagram. Follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook. If you need anything, let me know. All of my information is in the description of this video. Also, I'm going to be putting a one pager in the description of what um, items we talked about in this video. Okay. Happy organizing, and I will talk to y'all soon. Bye.